And in local news, Sand Springs police are asking the public for help this morning in finding an attempted rape suspect. And 2 News reporter Patricia Santos is live at River City Park with more on this developing story. Patricia? Well, Sand Springs police tell us they have extra officers patrolling the river trails here, and they're issuing a warning to joggers in the Tulsa metro area to be on the lookout for this individual. Now, on police say on Sunday afternoon, a man threatened a woman jogging on the trail here. He used a gun and a knife and led her into the woods. The victim told police the man tried to get her to perform sexual acts on him. It happened right around the bend of the trail near Highway 97. Now, she was able to wrestle her way out, and she believes he was stabbed on the leg during this incident. Right now, police are looking for any possible witnesses who can help identify this man. He's described as a slender white man, about six feet tall, blonde or gray hair. Now, he was wearing a ball cap, dark blue shirt, and cargo shorts on Sunday. He was riding a black bicycle with a hard or rigid case on the handlebars. Police are worried that he's stalk stalking victims in the Tulsa metro area. We think that uh, the disturbing thing is the time of day and the fact that he was armed and the, uh, the aggressive manner in which he took her. Uh, that makes us worry about this as far as uh, could he be out in the area. And here's a reminder from police, walk or jog with a buddy, carry your cell phone at all times and beware of your surroundings or any suspicious individuals and don't let your guard down even if it's daylight. Again, this incident happened around 420 in the afternoon. Right now, police are hoping to get a lead by using fingerprints or DNA evidence and they're asking anyone with information on this case to call Sand Springs Police at 918-245-8777. Live in Sand Springs, Patricia Santos, 2 News Works for you.